the first day of the Creative World Art Fair in Frankfurt happening live. That's where there's a buzz in the air. We're very excited to be here and having a great time introducing new products. I'm here with Rana Ada, the product manager, and with Lala Knippes, communication and marketing manager. So I got it right for the first time. That's good. My name is Danny Michalski, and now we're going to be talking about the natural line. I am so Hannah Müller is obviously very forward thinking, yet taking care of the environment, looking not to destroy trees, but looking to be sustainable and environmentally friendly. How do you do it? Hanmul um, has its focus since a long time, or since ever since, uh, on environmental, as uh, we are located um, since the beginning in an ecological protected area. So, and we are founded in 1580, Four. So, um, and you're still at the same at location the same to location. this date. Yes. Amazing. And you Which have your own protected area. And you have your own well running through it yeah. as well. And we produce there. That's our product, uh, production site. And yes. And therefore, we are always looking for new products, for things we could, yeah, do better. And we came out with the natural line, or with our first product. How long ago was this? Uh, that was in already 2008. 2008, so yeah. Yeah, so the natural line, it combines um, products from uh, bamboo? remarkable yeah, raw materials like bamboo, agave or hemp. Yeah, so extra, it's really extraordinary because you, yeah. I mean the sustainability part, the environment is really the number one theme of this line. Bam bamboo fast growing. All of them are fast growing. Hemp is fast growing and, and agave also as well. Ag yeah. agave as well. Okay. And they do need less water. Less so water. This is um, yeah the main point of all of the natural line products. We do protect the environment um, with these products. Very good. So Rana, would you like me to, because agave as a just a human being walking this earth, I've never come across that plant myself. Tell me more about it. The agave fibers that we are using to produce the agave watercolor paper is, um, is a very sustainable resource saving fiber which was used already min many thousand years ago by oh, the wow. Aztecs for That's example and they use it for clothes and ropes because it's a very strong fiber and we found out we did our development and research and we found out that agave is, uh, the fibers are really nice to produce a paper so we have used for this 70% uh, agave fibers and 30% cotton mm -hmm. and have uh, a very nice and beautiful uh, watercolor paper with cold pressed surface texture and very homogeneous. It gives you also very extraordinary watercolor effects. We offer them in, in blocks but also in sheets. So that's a block and it's kind of glued to the side and you kind of open it with a little knife, right? Yes, uh, with the bamboo uh, bone folder. folder. Yeah, ah, bone folder. the folder. Okay. And then Made from can, bamboo. Okay, Made from bamboo, yeah, right. Very good. And then you open it and then, then you can open it because it's on four sides glued. It's easier to paint on it when it's glued on all four sides. Yes. Besides a gave, we also have um, hemp fibers that we have used to develop a paper. It is our hemp sketch with 80 GSM. It's a sketch paper. It's combined with hemp fibers, 60% and 40% cotton fibers. And the paper itself, it's perfect for dry painting techniques. It has a very toothy, oh, yes. grainy surface texture. It holds the pigments. It is suitable for pencils, for charcoal, also for red chalk, but you can also make beautiful rollerball paintings on that. We have these hemp sketch and pads, just the in pads, pads only, yeah. only oh, in different pads. formats. In different yeah. formats, right? And then what we have is bamboo mixed media, okay, and bamboo sketch. The bamboo mixed media is also a product that we have launched 2008 already. We have it for 15 years. A bamboo paper made from 90% bamboo fibers and 10% cotton. These are suitable for mixed media. You can use watercolor on it, acrylic on it, pastel, fine liners. You can mix different media on that paper. And the same paper quality, we also have it in a thinner version, which is our bamboo sketch that mm -hmm. we offer in these books or also in, in pads. Pads. Mm -hmm. And um, 
they vary from how many grams? Um, we do, the, a gay watercolor has 290 yeah. gsm, which is important when you are working on watercolor, mm -hmm. then you need a bit thicker paper. Then we have the bamboo mix media, it's 265 gsm. 265, okay. Mm -hmm. And the sketch papers are a bit thinner because sketch, it's a dry painting yeah. technique, you don't need water. So it's uh, with 200, uh, 105 gsm, it's the bamboo sketch, and we have the 80 gsm with hemp sketch. So you brought the bamboo out a long, long time ago I and know. now people are following into your footsteps, I exactly. hear. <laughs> we heard anyway, something like that. You were first a long, long time ago and it's amazing. Sustainable, fast growing and um, yeah, you do good also, which is amazing. And artists love your papers as well, so that's why you're so successful and also a brand of the century. I mean, Hanemul is going to be 500 years old in about two decades-ish. I'm bad at mathematics, but anyway. Let me well, calculate. <laughs> nah, it's, too, it's too late in the day to calculate. <laughs> anyway, it's quality, it's forward thinking, and it's sustainable, and it's simply fantastic. Thank yeah. you so much, guys, for this introduction to the natural line. I simply love it. Thank you.